Hello and thanks again for joining me for another episode of Kenshi, uh, the Freedom Seekers Skeletons Only. And uh, we are on day four. Uh, we're getting ready to getting ready to cruise on up over to the Black Desert City. And uh, just gonna get a little bit more cash together. Now let's just check around for see if there was any bodies to loot. All right, come and grab this. Uh, not you. All right, so uh, when I've saved and reloaded, it has reordered all my guys. Okay, old rust. That's better. So, what have we got in here? All right. Uh, looks like we've got slavers over here. Uh, not really ready to fight the slavers just yet. So I think I'm just going to grab everybody, bring them up here. like they might just be passing by so okay let's put everybody back on their jobs uh old rust can come down here pick up some of this stuff and we'll sell this off uh what have we got down here cruising here then get some stuff together for a bit of a trip okay uh what's our run speed all right, I think, I think I'm going to swap out some gear. Uh, let's take that instead. Take those, they're a bit lighter. Um... Do we have backpacks? Have we got? Okay, so we've got a backpack in there. All right. So I'm going to grab some of these iron plates. Uh, maybe not that many. Come over here. Ah, uh, now what do we got? We got rebel farmers. We may as well uh, have a bit of a go at these guys. Ah, uh, but we can let's patch up these smugglers. Oh, as they are 
Hoping you see out a bit. All right. Let's pop that in there for a minute. Uh, let's grab that. See if these guys got anything worth looting. Another crossbow, take that. Uh, might actually swap that out for the for the shoddy one. It's a lot easier to get skills with the not so good quality ones. Uh, let's loot this bone dog before he gets up. Uh, most of these guys' stuff isn't really worth taking. That guy's getting up. Let's turn your range off. Over here, another bone dog. Outlaw swordsman. Usually, I have a couple of things we can take. Uh, this guy, probably nothing. All right, so uh, let's see. Let's pop all this in here. Just going to take that with me. Uh, we'll shove that in there. Down here. All right, so let's see. Let's go trade the springs. Springs, stand still for a minute. Uh, let's see. I'm going to take that. Am I in range of this? Yep. Okay, so springs can have that. Uh... All right, we'll trade with bolts. And I'm going to take those pants. All right, we go in here. Let's take that. Sell this copper before we make our trip. And the meat, I don't need that. Okay. Uh, these guys getting up again. All right, old rust over here.
Okay, so, uh, let's pop that in there for a sec. Let's pop that in there, we'll take, uh, that's one of our plates in it. Pop that in there, pop that in there, uh, what other weapons do we have? Not much. Let's pop that in there, uh, actually. Pop that one in there. Okay, so check our run speed, 19, 14. All right. Uh, let's see. All right, I'd like to get a bit more run speed. So I think what we'll do... Pop that in there. Let's just get a couple of, uh, a level or two of strength up. So I'd like to be like to be able to run a little bit faster for our trip. So we get another point of strength so that uh, we're not so encumbered. Maybe we'll try and get up to 28. Way we won't be so way down for our run. So we might as well pick up some of this and run it into the shop. Might as well be doing something while we're uh, while we're getting this leveled up. Sell that. Let's uh, put this up. Pop down this guy. So we're still, still weighed down. about All right. put that in there put that in there uh, I suppose we're not taking our uh... alright we're not taking our crossbow so I suppose we can uh, leave the bolts behind Take that one out of there. I suppose we don't really need to take that. Alright. 
flip that over. Let's pop that one in there. That one in there. Pick this guy up. Let's uh, put our bolts away. Get another level of strength. Really would like to be travelling at least at 16. Just pop all of this stuff in this bag. Almost 29. Right, so there's 29. Let's see if we can get him up to 30. Yeah, it shouldn't be too hard. So we might as well pick up some more of this stuff. Drop some more of this stuff off in the shop. So I've almost got 30. Let's head back over here now. And we'll drop off this bag. And we'll check our run speed again. Pop that in there. Um, yeah, that weighs five kilos. So it's probably better off putting that in there. All right, let's drop this body. Fifteen. All right, let's pop that in there for now. 
and we'll just quickly try and get a few more, uh, just a couple more athletics points. And looks like we do have company somewhere. Bad ninjas. Okay. Change of plan. Let's uh, grab this. Let's pop all that stuff in there. Come up, see if we can fight these guys off. All right, let's loot these guys. Yeah, actually, we'll give that to Bolts. All right. Uh, where's the other one? Over here. Make sure he's down. Alright, let's try that again. So, like gear upgrade there. Okay, uh, let's come back up here now. Everybody else can go on their jobs. Let's just shove all this in here. Up that in there. But I guess I'll keep that one for myself. Pop that one in there. Pop these in here. Okay. Well, uh, let's put that in there. So this is the one. Of our steel. All right. Yeah, we don't need to be carrying five kilos, so one of these is a lot lighter. I will pop that in there for now. This one weighs zero. All right, let's check our uh, check our run speed now. 
16. While we load it up, uh, let's just have that here. See if that makes a difference. Still 16. I think 16 should be fast enough. All right, so now we're going to take old rust on a trip over here. And hopefully the 16 will be enough to outrun anything along the way. Um, might get a slight bump up along the way. So we're heading over to the Black Desert City where we're going to recruit Sad Neil. If we can make it there. Rebel farmers are having a go at us. If we can make it into the acid rain, that'll start uh, tearing those guys down. We've just got to get past the uh, past the iron spiders. The guys are still chasing. Oh, well, that one's a, that one's a hiver, so the acid rain's not going to bother him. All right. Let's uh, get into the bar here. Okay, we're looking for a skeleton in here. Upstairs, there he is, Sad Neil, so we're going to talk to him. And he's all very depressed. We'll speak to him. And we now have a new recruit. Just going to add a new squad here. These two guys in here for now. Raid. All right. Sad Neil can have that one. Sad Neil can have this bag, pants, and armor. These guys take out the rural farmers down here. Looks like it. So let's uh, see if they've got anything worth looting. Not really. All right, Sad Neil can pick this guy up. And I'll give that one to Sad Neil. So he's got a uh, repair kit on him. And we're going to send Sad Neil down here and he can start mining that iron node there. Old Rust. Come downstairs here. Buy myself a new repair kit. All right, so uh, over here, I think it's this one. Yep, we can buy that one for 16000 We are going to do that. Doesn't need any fixing up. Um, we are going to go storage here. We are going to put in an ore storage. 
Now, funny thing about this building is that, so, you know, when, when you're placing things that the characters interact with, you have these little, uh, you know, the little green person icons. And if it's green, it means that they can, uh, you know, that they can access it from that point. See how that one there goes red? It means they can't access it from that point. The thing about this building is you can actually position it. You can position this so that it's kind of accessible through the wall. Like that. And uh, so Sad Neil will be doing mining. He'll be bringing stuff back to that. He won't need to go inside. You'll actually be able to access that from the outside. Uh, and now, uh, let me see. Let's get our research bench two. And we're going to place this up on the roof here. And old Ross will get them built. And I think also we'll put in another storage down here just for iron plates. We'll need a few iron plates down here to upgrade that uh, that research bench. And if there's any opportunity, Sad Neil might loot some iron plates. From uh, some iron spiders. We'll just plonk that down there. And actually, what we might do. Let's uh, turn old Rust off, off of his jobs. Let's just put all the plates in there. Let's get Sad Neil. Let's uh, put Sad Neil on engineering and he can build that himself. Okay. So old Rust now can head back home. And we'll change the squad. These guys are still running around. He's getting burnt up by acid. So there's acid rain in that area, skeletons are not affected by it, neither are hivers. Oh, chasing me now. We've got to swing in. Looks like they might be going to chase me all the way. So let's grab everybody. Uh, who have we got here? Springs. That's an animal trader. We're not worried about animal trader. All right. Let's bring everybody up here. Let's bring you guys down here. See if the nomads will get involved in this. Maybe not.
Okay. So, let's uh, loot these guys. Uh, you can have a bow again. You can have your sandals back. I don't care for sandals. Seeing as skeletons can't wear shoes. All right. You guys can all have your jobs back on. Let's loot their bone dog so it doesn't get up again. Now, did only one of them follow us home? Does appear that way. Alrighty. So, old Ross can come over here. Let's have a look in here. Let's grab this bag. Yeah, what have we got in here? So let's uh, sell off some of this stuff. All right, old Rusty can come up here. Uh, actually, on your way. Let's uh, pick up some of that. Swap out the bags. Alright. So I'll sell some of this stuff. Then we'll need to uh, buy some science books. Do some repairs. So the plan is, with Sad Neil over staying over in the uh, Black Desert City, um, he can do a bit of mining there. And as we can afford it, uh, let's see. Uh, let's just drop a couple of these things, take that. So, as we can afford it, over in the Black City, we'll get Sad Neil to, uh, to go along to a place called the Scrap House, which is just outside of the Black City. And, uh... It is a place that sells a few ancient science books. Let's just grab the stuff that's valuable. And so what he can do without having to run all the way there and back again, we can, uh, we can get Sad Neil to buy them. While he's there, put him straight into his research bench and research what we need to research. All right, so let's uh, sell off this stuff. And I do keep first aid kits on me, just basic first aid, just in case we need to patch up the uh, any of the shopkeepers and uh, you know any of the guards that are around here that are that are keeping us safe. 
This guy does have a bounty on him, but uh, not too fussed about that. All right, and that shopkeeper is out of cash. What about this one? So some of those there, uh, we will buy some ordinary science books to start with though. This guy doesn't have any. So we'll buy some in here. Uh, let's just loot this guy first. Take that. Okay, so I'll pop in here, sell this stuff. Uh, we'll buy as many of those as we can. We'll pop these in our little bench over here. And then we'll go back to Sad Neil. All right, so pop these in here. Uh, we will get uh, Tech Level 3 going. You can have your jobs back on. Head over to Sad Neil and uh, okay, let's. It was good timing. We can go loot this uh, iron spider here. Let's uh, see if we can patch up these guys as well. All right, so what we'll do, uh, where are we? Over here. We'll get Sad Neil on the research bench. Uh, we'll get him to all those plates as well. And we'll just stash those electronics in there for the time being. All right, so Sad Neil is now doing our research. And uh, it's got some iron plates here to upgrade this. And then we'll start producing some other things as we, we get our tech level up. So by doing that also, we didn't need to worry about putting up power to get our, uh, our next tech bench up. But that is going to do it for this episode. So if you did enjoy this video, please leave me a like or a comment down below. If you'd like to see more, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.